big for me. Of course it's not. That's a fashion, isn't it? It's really, really smart, you know. Cheers. I'm oh, glad you like it. That's the score you owe me. You said you liked it. Yeah, I know, but... Mrs. Singh, and she ain't paid a penny off them since. Right. Right. Or well, while you're at it, see if you can get her interested in any of this gear. Excuse me. Oh. Sorry, can you tell me if Mrs. Singh's in at all? Mrs. Singh don't live here anymore. She moved away about three weeks ago. I've taken her flat. Great. Did she say where she was moving to? Bangladesh. <laughs> I thought we'd lost her. Are you coming in or not? Yeah, okay. Yeah, these are big <laughs> oh, I hope you don't mind me asking, but have you been ill recently? <laughs> or lost a lot of weight? This? <laughs> no, no, it's, you know, it's fashion. <laughs> Sorry, yeah. Rodney. Irene. No, Rodney. <laughs> Nice to meet you, Irene. Come on, you know I'm thinking about you all the time. Oui. Yeah? I mean, yeah? <laughs> Can I dip my bread in your egg? <laughs> Help yourself. Thanks very much. <laughs> what do you mean? About 30. How old is she exactly? 40. <clears throat> She's even too old for me. Well, I'd have to think twice. Shut up, Granddad. What's the matter with you? It's Irene. Oh, don't tell me. They've turned down her free bus pass. What's up with him? Oh, some old tart's giving him the sack. <laughs> you know what he's like, don't you? Rodney. Oh, hello, Marcus. This is Irene's son. This is my brother. Oh. All right, Del? Yeah, hello, son. Mm. Oi, Marcus. How did you know his name? I met him on Thursday when he took Mum out for a drink. <laughs> <laughs> you took Irene out? It's too big, man. No, no. No, it isn't. No, that was <laughs> Oh, that's beautiful. Yours isn't too big. Ah, but this is small on me. You won't catch cold in there. <laughs> you bet your life you've heard it before, sunshine. You've been seen out with my wife, Trotter. Guilty or not guilty? Oh, no, I was only just having a friendly drink. But I'm not a friendly geezer. Opening ready. Well, it shouldn't be difficult, should it? 
I mean, some food, a speaker, a bit of publicity. Yeah, Harry, about your new chambermaid. All I need now is an outbreak of typhus to wipe out my guests, and I've got me there. And that kind of thing makes me very angry. I'm going to teach you a lesson you'll remember for the rest of your life, Rodney, my old son. Had a bit of luck tonight. I bumped into Tommy McKay. I've left the path clear for you and Irene. Me and Irene? Yeah. Oh, that's all over, do. Was just infatuation, but this is love. Oh. <laughs> Oi, here she is now. 